strange things happen when I'm around. It doesn't bother me, not anymore. I'm used to the stairs, the whispers. But I wish I didn't have to hide who I am. I wish there was a place where I belong. What was that? Traveled all the way on Hagrid's flying motorbike, and the experience was mm. unforgettable. Looks like I drove a little too fast for you. Um, good. Let's have a look at your list. I'm not even sure how to describe what I mean. Here for new robes, dear. Oh, come, don't be shy. got to look good for school. Perhaps a change is in order. Maybe I should go with a more classic look? You look marvellous! A portrait of a moral Hogwarts student. Let's see what else is on your list, shall we? A wand, of course. Uh, you'll want Ollivander's for that, dear. His shop is very close. You'll see. your robes, have you? Then it's time to get you a wand. This here is Ollivander's. Best ones money can buy. Go on. Your wand's waiting. Ah, another young wizard. 
There is something familiar about you. Come, try out this wand. Apparently not. Come, try out this wand. <laughs> oh my, curious. Very curious. here for a wand too? Actually, I've already got one. It's just been acting a bit strange recently. Hmm. Twelve and a half inches, cherry wood, and dragon heart string. A powerful combination in the right hand. That's what my Nana said. She taught me a few spells, but... I can't do them anymore. Could there be something wrong with my wand? Would you be so kind as to demonstrate, young miss? Well done. I haven't seen a young witch or wizard take to their wand that quickly since... Uh, since... Hmm. That was wonderful! Thanks. I couldn't have done it without your help. Hopefully, now I won't make a fool of myself when I get to Hogwarts. You're going to Hogwarts? Me too! I'm Ivy Warrington, by the way. Nice to meet you, Ivy. You too. I'll see you at school. See you there. Ventus.
If my wand is fine, then maybe something about me did change. But what? I don't remember anything. Do I? It all seems so foggy. I think so, yes. Thanks again for your help. My pleasure. Thought I'd get you a gift, being as you're new to magic. An owl is mighty useful. Y you do like owls, don't you? Of course you do. Come on then, let's find you a good one. There. You must be the student Hagrid mentioned. Oh, yes, he's quite fond of you. <laughs> I couldn't decide on an owl, so he left it up to you to choose. Uh, go on, then. Have a look for yourself. <laughs> Hi there, friend. Want to come with me? <laughs> Isn't Diagon Alley amazing? Oh yes! I've always enjoyed coming here. Although, I can't remember the last time. That's odd. Me too. I think. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so forgetful today. Got everything you need? You must be excited to go to Hogwarts. Don't worry. You'll get there soon enough. And since it's your first time in Diagon Alley, you can walk around a bit more if you like. Got everything you need? You must be excited. Since it's your first time in Diagon Alley, you... Hey! Who are you? My name's Robin. Pleasure to meet you, Robin. So, do you like Quidditch, or do you love it? I don't really know much about Quidditch. What are you, a muggle? Oh, oh, sorry. You aren't really a muggle, are you? Sorry, was it wrong to ask that? Huh, Merlin's beard, I'm terrible at introductions. Hello, are you going to Hogwarts? Yes, I am. I suppose you want to know my name, too. It's Daniel. Daniel Page. If you don't mind, I'm kind of busy, so... Sorry. Uh, good luck finding a cauldron. See you at school. Sure. Bye. And you are? Oh, uh, Kevin Farrell. At your service. For what it's worth. Sorry, I'm a little nervous. It's nice to meet you. Don't worry, I get nervous too. Thanks. 
At least I won't be the only one at Hogwarts. I'm sure you'll do fine. See you at school. I suppose you want to know my- Yes, I'm pleased to meet you, Cassandra. I'm sure you are. Everyone is. Are you going to Hogwarts? Obviously. My name has been on the list for ages. Now, if you don't mind, I have shopping to do. Goodbye. Got everything you need? You must be excited to go to Hogwarts. Since it's your first time in Diagon Alley, you can... Before I knew it, it was time to go to school. Excuse me, may I sit here? Actually, no, you may not. I'm sure there are plenty of other seats. Off you go! Um, uh, may I sit next to you? Sure, if you can find room, I mean. My friend Kev really likes to read. Actually, Kev is under there sometimes. I think. Hello. Remember me? Ivy Warrington. We met at Ollivander's. Of course. How could I forget our adventure against the monster book? You were brilliant. You can sit with me if you'd like. Isn't this exciting? We're finally going to Hogwarts. I'm a little nervous, actually. Don't be. I hear the castle is amazing. I can't wait to go exploring. became headmistress. Barely four months had passed since the Battle of Hogwarts. Since Voldemort and his followers were defeated, thanks to the combined efforts of many heroic witches and wizards, forest dwellers and house elves, and students, much like yourselves. Hopefully, none of you will ever face such evil. But should challenges arise, know that together you are capable of much more than you might think. Now, to those feeling overwhelmed by the occasion, remember that even Harry Potter once stood where you do. Hmm. I know you're all starving, but first we must see to the sorting of our newest students into their houses. This is very important, as your house will be akin to your family while you are at Hogwarts. They will share your triumphs and your failures. Is everyone ready? Yes? All right, form a line. 
After that, the sorting began proper. One by one, students were sorted into their houses. And then, it was my turn. Shall I put you? Trustworthy, loyal, and modest. All there, I see. And just a hint of tenacity. Excellent. They'll appreciate that in Hufflepuff. Ivy? Does anyone know what happened to Ivy? I see. Hagrid? Yes, Headmistress? I believe a search party is in order. It appears we have lost a student. I can't believe Ivy has gone missing. She seemed so excited to come to Hogwarts. She helped me in the wand shop, so now it's my turn to help her. If there's still no news of her tomorrow, I'll have to go look for her. <sighs> I'm exhausted. I can't believe so much has happened. <sighs> and it's just the first day. Come on! You don't want to be late for your first class. If we hurry, we can still make it on time. Hmm.
there you are. Hurry along and find your seats. Class is about to begin. Yes, Professor. Once upon a time, a student named Ron Weasley, as you may have heard, beat an adult troll in his first year. And he did it with none other than this charm, protecting his friends Harry Potter and Hermione Granger in the process. Atmosphere charm. was impressive. You must have practiced a lot. Not really. I'm just naturally talented. Oh. I wish I was that good. Yes. Well, I'm sure you'll get better. It's just a swish. And a flick. That's right. I'll keep practicing. If you're looking to practice, Dueling Club is the place to do it. You can join me if you like. You're not afraid. My name is Cassandra, by the way. All right, I'll give it a try. Oh, wait, my name is... Uh, oh, she's gone. on whatever spells you know. Come with me. 
I do hope you won't make a scene when you lose. Acromantula Benham. Spiders. Inflitus. Well, well, someone knows how to do. Bravo. But perhaps you'd like a real challenge, say, against Fisher here. And myself. Two against one? How is that fair? Oh, she means a duo duel. Two against two. But you'll need a partner. Not a problem. Let's do this. corridor at the charms. My name is... Right, right. I remember. You asked me about levitation charms. It would seem that you know more than you let on. Still, defeating a fray is nothing to get excited about. When you've improved, I'll do you again, if you're up for it. I'd like that. I mean, I look forward to it. And I'll be ready, I promise. Yes. Well, we'll see about that.
Ah. Mm -mm. Set these bubble blasts off in the boys' toilet. No, let's do Filch's office. I like the way you think, brother. You two look like you're up to no good. What's in the box? What box? I don't see no box. Clearly, I mean the box right there. What? This? This ain't no box. It's a. Uh... A collection of explosive accessories. Dangerous delights. In other words, none of your business. Ah, well, it sounds like Filch is coming. So, unless you and your not box want detention, you may want to scram. Oh, I got a better idea. Why don't you explain to Filch what you're doing with these? Later, loser. What a pair of gits. Filch is in the prefect's bathroom cleaning up after peeves. Again. Now, what are these things? I think Fisher called them a bombastic bomb box. Oops. I don't want to be late for charms. Better take these with me. I'll turn them in after class. What are they doing here? You told us Filter was coming, but he was nowhere near, was he? That means you tricked us, and we don't like to be tricked, do we, brother? 
We do not. Fantastic bomb. Spiders. Infuriating. But these bombastic bomb boxes are fun. I should probably get rid of these. I wouldn't want Filch to think they're mine. <laughs> Is that your riding? A box of boomtastic bubble blasts? Please, it's just a misunderstanding. These aren't mine. Ah, I've heard that one before, haven't I? Now hand them over. What is that your riding? Please, it's. Ah, I've heard. Let's just say I've run into some rather explosive troubles with the caretaker. Filch? Yeah, he's got it in for me too. He's convinced I was pilfering potions ingredients from the storeroom, which I definitely was not. Ah, such delightful drama. Stay cool and composed and all problems will be solved. A great wizard keeps their calm, even in the most dire of circumstances. Oh, uh, if you've got any suggestions, I'm listening. <clears throat> Very well. Allow me to tell you about a duel that took place in the Ministry of Magic not so long ago. I didn't witness it myself, of course, but I have friends hung in the Ministry who say it was most epic.
Skywalker. I heard that other than spells, Quidditch is also quite fun, but my personal favorite is potions. Quidditch? Is that that sport where you get to ride a broomstick and fly around? That's the one. You'll want to talk to Robin if you're interested. Heard she's recruiting flying bodies in the Great Hall. Ventis.
Ah, 